So Joe, there is one other thing you can change it to that's sort of standard for a Nuzlocke called set mode versus switch mode. Okay. I don't know if you've noticed yet, but when you kill someone who has multiple Pokemon in their party, it says they're about to send out, you know, Trimeca. Would you like to switch Pokemon? Technically, the common rule of thumb is to put it on set mode, which is they will throw Pokemon first before you even get the chance to switch out. And then if you want to waste that turn, put in a different Pokemon, that's your choice. So it makes it a little bit harder because you can't preemptively decide, oh, they're going to throw out a fire type. Let me get my water type in. Interesting. So it's up to you. You can do what you want, but it is something that we can we can switch. Also, there's another route coming up. Yeah. I think that would be like a good addition because then you'd be like, uh oh, now I gotta like think on the fly. Sticks. You gotta think like, oh, who's yeah. who can who can take a hit coming in? I'm, I'm down to do that. Battle style shift and set. That's what it's called, and that'll make it so if there's multiple Pokemon, it just throws out the next one. You gotta just deal with it. But yeah, where are you at right now? I forget. I'm just in 30, just moving around. Oh, you're just grinding away. You Pretty... fought those two trainers, right? Yeah, I fought the two trainers. I haven't gone farther, though. Yeah, you go north of them, there's another route for another encounter. Wait, I got we're... five Pokeballs. Is that enough? Do I spend my last $400? I'm doing it. Now I have seven Pokeballs. I had to spend all my money because of that stupid Celebi. I'll agree with whatever Stag says. Oh, what? So I might be over-leveling a little bit? What level are you right now, my friend? Turbo is six. Fruit and Reggie are still both seven, and Rockstar is 11. Yeah, you're good. Route 31. I'm gonna run and do my route and see what the encounter is. Oh, first. First block of grass. No way, no way. Who's he getting? Who's he getting? Oh, it's a milk tank, dude. What's with my Pokemon pool? It's gonna roll out and kill me. I can feel it in my nuggies. No, I believe. Come on, you got it. Pokeball off the rip. We're gonna see what it does. Uh, it broke out after one shake. Hey, at least you wow. got a shake, dude. Reggie ran off the rip, dude. Didn't even give me a shake. It's not very nice of him. It's almost like he's a legendary or something. Whoa, that's a lot of damage. We have caught the milk tank. All right, so trainer one, trainer two. That girl is not a trainer. She's just like, hey, if I was a trainer, you'd have to fight me. Uh, Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, she scared me. Can I go around, around this guy? I don't even think he fights. He might fight. I don't remember if he does. Nuggets. Dude's got a Lucario. Steel fighting. Who? I don't even know what steel fighting would even be. I don't think I have a counter for that. Flying, ground, and fire. Well, Reggie's a... Well, Turbo's a fire, but I don't have a fire move. No, Turbo will die to that. Fire, fighting, and ground. Excuse me. That's what he's weak to. Uh, I'll bring Reggie. I will warn you. Reggie is a normal type, and Lucario is a fighting type, but I don't know what fighting type moves he knows at this low level. He used Detect. Uh, that's fine. Who cares? So, should I swap Reggie out? Nah. Reggie could take a hit from this guy. Okay. Reggie's so big. He is a big boy. That did nothing. What level is he? Three. Oh, thank God. If he was level six, he'd have counter, and I, I could just see you dying to it. Would a normal attack do? It's not going to do a lot. It's going to do very little, actually. So maybe I should swap out. I mean, Reggie's going to be able to survive anything he throws at it. He doesn't Wait. have any fighting type moves yet. I don't know if Dizzy Punch would make him double confused. Oh, wow. Nah, it doesn't exist. All right, Lucario fainted. Solid, solid. Le Reggie just oh. got level eight. Let's go. The level gap is real. Oh, another Lucario. What the heck? My uh, second verse, same as the first. I need a good nickname for Miltank. First name that came to mind was Mikey. It's a female. Ah. I'll tell you that. Oh, holy Jesus, Mom. You can't scare me like that. Did she call you? Yeah. <laughs> oh, my God. For Miltank. Molly? Molly? Dude, oh, you're going to have a lot of... Oh, the only names I'm going to be able to recommend are, like, names, like, based off... Human their... names? Well, not just, like, Miltank, Mikey, Miltank, Molly. Hello? Beans? Mother? I heard from Professor Elm that you went on a long trip. Oh, yeah, because I kind of didn't say bye to her. Uh-oh. Wish Lens you would have told- Oh, up Mom, now I feel bad. Why is that? Mother just said, I wish you would have told me about your long trip. Oh, well. Woo! We found a fossil. Let's Keep go, Joe. Oh, oh, thanks, Bob. Sorry for being a shitbag son and not telling you about my adventure, but I appreciate you. Oh, Route 31. That's where I caught my milk tank. I'm scared. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, no, actually, you know what? Yeah, solid. Let's save. Let's save. I think there's two more battles on Route 31 with trainers, and then there's also the Dark Cave, but I'm already at five Pokeballs again, so I'm feeling a little bit nervous about going in there. It hasn't broke, so we ain't changing up the strategy. We're putting Rockstar right in front. I like it. I like it. May I ask once again for a glorious countdown into Route 31? Three, two, one, go, go, go. Oh, fourth one in. What are we thinking? Who are we going to get? Who are we going to get? Okay, we got a, a Clefable? Clefable? Clefable is really strong. And yeah, we're gonna do a Constrict off rip. See how much damage that does. Not a lot, but that's fine. That's fine. I, I just it got front hand, back hand twice. 
Okay, so like the only thing you gotta be careful of knows the move metronome. What does that mean? Metronome is a move that will randomly select a move from all of the moves in Pokemon and use it. So it could be Growl, it could be Tackle, it could be <laughs> Draco Meteor, it, it could, could be, be Hyper Beam, it could be Sheer Force and one tap anybody it hits no matter what. Just gonna keep keep her going. My attack missed though. Keep her going. Oh yeah, because she keeps doing this like minimize thing. Oh yeah, that means her uh, evasiveness has gone up, and it's harder to hit. So I think first, first time it goes yellow, it's right there. Could definitely get another solid attack in. That just hit me like three times. What the heck? So we're just gonna, you know, it's yellow. The start. We're just gonna throw one, you know. Can't hurt to be too cautious. I have ten pokeballs. I might as well use them. Yeah. Not even a tick. Wow. There's only one more fight inside of the town. Or inside of the Route 31. The guy has four Pokemon, though. But <gasps> it's something to kind of be careful of. It used Metronome. It used Metronome. It used Metronome. What's it gonna it be? It tucked in its head in its defense, bros. Oh, my oh! god. That's uh, Shell Bash, I think. I think it's a Water-type move. Do not switch out Rockstar. All I'm saying is anyone else will die to this. Let's go. We got him, baby. Clefeeble is a part of the squad. Let's go. Now I need a nickname for Clefeeble. Ooh, I don't know. It's a good-ass Pokemon, though. Dude, we got, we got a good-ass squad going right now. Yeah, so it was going to use the move Skull Bash. Uh, that's 130 power, just so you know. What does that mean? It means it's going to do a fuckload of damage to you. <laughs> and it's normal type, actually, so you would have resisted it. Ooh, 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 Joe, we get another free encounter in this city. Ooh. I'm probably just gonna say this every single time, but for any new viewers in the stream, if you guys have any ideas for nicknames for the mons that we capture, throw them in the chat. Your nickname could be chosen for Clefeeble right here. Because honestly, I'm stumped. There's not a name that pops in my mind. Yo, I can't pin the message. You pin the message. Oh, sh I, yeah, because I can do that. Let me do that and be a good streamer. Yeah. Now the big question of what do you name this little lady, little guy? I don't know what it is. It is a lady. What do you name this little lady? I don't know, man. There's really no names that are uh, popping out. I like the name Strawberry. Strawberry? Strawberry. I'm close. It's okay, Stifle. Do you got me? I'm right there Welcome with you, buddy. The but honestly, I could see strawberry. You know, it's got the strawberry color. It's got some like acute points. Let's see if strawberry fits. Well, let's play it. I found a hidden item. I swear, this being in alphabetical order makes it so much harder. You can always use your stylus to click on these, you know. This is true. Yeah, it does fit perfect. Ooh, bubblegum. That's also bubble a good gum one. Also I like that probably one. probably fits perfectly. Oh, wait. I almost forgot. Hold on. I gotta yeah, add that's... the boy to the squad. Oh, and your picture? Yeah, now that now that I know that uh, I can use this guy, I can have milk tank. There's the homie. Big bobbin, big vibin'. And look at that. Strawberry's even got a pink sphere to hang out. We got two pink Pokemon. Yo, I kind of been really digging. Like, most of the Pokemon that I have have been like color coordinated with their spears. It's like worked out really well. You've also been getting heavy hitters. The fable is kind of crazy. Yo, this but I do have Gengar. Right is fucking Jellybee. going nuts. I'm going to wait here with the guy that'll give us a free Pokemon. All right. What would you think, Dixon? Would you be confident that I could just go straight up to that dude? Beat his ass? Yeah. He's got four level two Pokemon. Is it this up. guy? No, I would skip that cave though. I skipped it just because I don't have enough Pokeballs to confidently catch whatever's in there. Revival? Er. Oh, you could sell that because it's useless in a nuzla yeah uh-oh so the fat guy is not the guy it's the bug guy he's also guarding a pokeball i think i can just hop over here and get the pokeball you'll have to fight him on the way back out though should i just like skip these guys then for now if you really want to you can walk up and around the back of the fat guy and just go straight to the town I that, go... it might be better to heal i don't know i mean they're not that weak but they always come back i feel like you could rock anything that guy has unless he's got something that you literally can't hit because it has wonder guard then you're screwed either way so yeah what is up to you I'm just gonna play want? it safe for now. Oh, look who that is. Look at who it is. You know, I'm actually just gonna like... Ah. Oh. oh, it has shadow tag. That means yours has shadow tag. So that means anytime the Clefable shows up, they're locked in. They can't switch out. Knock them out. You'll probably one tap it or... Oh. Where the fuck did you come from, you stalker? Oh, yeah, you knew it was me. You were following me this whole damn time. She is a stalker, man. How'd you get past? Oh, well, lady, I haven't seen you this entire time until you almost, like, jumped the cops. Here's something neat for your, for surprising me, beans. I got a versus recorder. Let me stash that in my pocket real fast. This can record my Pokemon battles. Ooh. If you say I'm not gonna let you pass me again and go to the right to go behind me, I'm gonna laugh. Okay. <laughs> Oh, who's this banana head looking dude? He trades shards for berries. You don't have any shards, so he will give you no berries. See the like dude in the tank top? He's the guy who will give you a free Pokemon egg. Technically you can get three, but we're just gonna take one because 
first encounter is what we get, you know? In order to do that, I need you to tell me your trainer ID, which is on your beans card. My trainer ID. Is it 31956? Yeah. Thanks. All right, so you want one, two, or three? Oh, I get the pit. Oh, okay. It's gonna be random, so, because there's three different eggs, so, like, you want egg one, two, or three? One, two, or... I mean, we could just do egg one, because we have one more Pokemon left, or... For some reason, number three is call my name. Oh, yeah? I like it, because number three is uh, is normally turbo. All right, so you're gonna talk to the guy, right? Okay. And he's gonna be like, yo, I'm a TV star or something stupid. I don't remember I should be a familiar saying. face to every Pokemon fan. Not anymore. You washed up. Up, buddy show me the show i'm primo the big brother so he's gonna ask you to quote something from his show so it's gonna be a bunch of words you sort by abc it's just easier that way first word you're looking for the word magnet pole magnet pole and then the second word is tangled feet which is under t angled feet he's like oh you feel like that about me uh -huh. wow. he's gonna get all flustered when you say this to him so this is something that is unique to every single person's trainer ID and what game they're playing. So good luck figuring this out normally. Wow. <laughs> I never thought of it that way before. By the way, how'd you like the way I am so exciting and fun? I don't like the way you sound. <laughs> Uh, the first word is test and the second word is flowers. How would you find this out like normally? Like Great just... question. <gasps> you are no ordinary fan and knowing such a thing. You are a trainer, right? He kills you on the spot. <laughs> yeah. It just takes me out right then and there. Lobs my head off. I think I can swing a deal and give you this egg. You take good care of it. This is a drug deal. Straight up, bro. I got the Badu egg from Primo. I don't know if it's actually a Badu, but that might be what you get. Will or that won't? might actually be what you get, unfortunately. So I wasn't able to choose my egg? Uh, you chose an egg randomly, one of three, and then he gives you a random egg. The way you hatch an egg is just by walking around with it. I got a deli bird egg. Well, we'll see if it's actually a deli bird. And so the way it hatches is you just walk around a lot while it's in your party. So we can do that now. You could potentially use that plus button on your uh, thing to, to ha speed up that hatching. Or we could just not do that if you don't want to and we can hatch them naturally we can do is do it all natural i to talk to this guy in this suit he looks weird so that egg if you uh click on it it'll kind of tell you generally how close it is to hatching you just talk to the egg and it's like oh i'm close to hatching or i'm not close to hatching at all oh, right there now we have to fight the gym leader but in order to do that you have to clear a tower that's inside the city there is technically more encounters we can have here this looks like the gym thing oh it's a pokemon school all right class today i'm gonna teach you all how to not be a bitch i need that class <laughs> thank you for tuning into my master class oh no that's one this is 100 the gym but the gym leader is not there if you talk to this guy he'll tell you you got to go north of the city so there's one encounter we're gonna have in this tower because this tower is full of uh wild pokemon oh wait are we doing the gym battle now we have to clear a tower first <gasps> tits route 32 oh have we done route 32 no we have not running away you can do it before the gym but you might want to get some more pokeballs first before we do all these encounters the reason i say hold off we still have to definitely do one more encounter before the gym i have eight pokeballs and one premier ball and three potions better safe than sorry who's my pokemon it's a togepi oh you got you, you got, got your egg no uh in the tower north of the city next to the gym oh i didn't even go up here it's bell sprout tower it's normally just full of bell sprouts joey is called me. Good evening, beans. That's a little fucking Can I freaky. Catch this it's me, Joey. Were you oh, awake? Yeah, I was on, dead asleep, Togepi. dude. Caught a wild war turtle. Hey, Thought about going rip. for it, but then I failed. Oh, Joey, come on, man. I believed in you. Joey. I guess that's just the way it goes. I'm not very good at catching Pokemon. That's okay, Joey. Poor dude just called me, got all sad, and then dipped. All right, so now what do I do in this tower? Do I just walk around? Uh, you climb to the top and fight the guy at the top to get the gym leader to do his thing. Are these bald guys gonna fight me? They will, yes. These two on the first floor do not fight you. Who's Joe's encounter? A Glade. Ooh, that's really good. It's psychic and it's strong. And fighting. It's psychic, fighting, and it's strong. I am now scared. Uh, dude, every freaking new encounter has me terrified. I get Togepi. You get this, like, psychic fighting warrior. <laughs> Come on, man. You use teleport. Oh. Well, bye, Togepi. I'll miss you. Dude, are you serious? Yep, there's the encounter. Does that technically count as a death? Not a death. It's just a lost encounter. Laundry was transferred to box one. 
You'll never become big laundry. Dude, oh my, are you kidding me? That is such a disappoint. Oh my god, man. No Pokemon for us. I am like angry. I'm more just shocked and sad than any. I can't believe I literally did like little blip of damage and the dude just dipped. Well, now what? Do I leave the tower? Uh, no, you gotta get to the top of the tower to beat the boss. Yeah, I have I no idea where the alone. hell. I guess I have to get to that ladder over there. Oh my, I'm, dude, I'm. <sighs> Depressed so at the loss of your special little guy. Bro, I I'm missing my Togepi right now, too, Joe. <laughs> I could have had Big Laundry again. I named it Laundry because when it evolved, it was going to get its name changed to Big Laundry. Wait, how am I supposed to even get over there? Keep on climbing those ladders. Well, that one goes down. Keep on going through the ladders. It's only one path. That's why I was saying, like, be careful with your levels a little bit because there's so many dudes inside this tower. Oh, my dude, I'm... <laughs> I'm crushed, man. Yeah, Gallade is awesome. The Nuzlocke was going, like, almost too good. And then I just got fucking hit with a reality check. Um, oh, yeah, by the way, no Pokemon at this encounter. Damn, Rockstar getting fat XP. Oh, yeah? What's Rockstar's level now, 12? Uh, it's 11, but he just got, like, 112 XP. Heck, yeah. He's gonna water gun to everything. Black Sludge? Ooh, I can get Black Sludge to Vinny. Vinny's poison type. Black Sludge heals poison-type Pokemon over time. Ooh. That's a huge... What does it... I can also give it to Gengar. So it poisons Mime every Junior. other Pokemon. Mime Jr.'s weak sauce. Although... I don't like how you said that. <laughs> no, I'm thinking of a different Pokemon. Mime Jr. is fine. I was thinking of Why Not. It's also a very tiny little insignificant spec, but it also has moves like Counter, Mirror Coat, and Destiny Bond that are all made to kill you. Rockstar is now level 12. You just can't get past level 13. So you may want to start training up some other guys on the way up. Throw in Strawberry and then just yeah, swap. I like Strawberry. Strawberry's stats are really good. And the move pool can learn items is so, it's so good. Granted, in Randomized, it's all 50%. Oh, come on. The Feebas has levitate, so I can't even hit it with my magnitude. The floating fish doesn't get hit by rich, the ground. Uh, rich girl Donna. Hey, rich girl Donna. How you doing? Joey, this is the second time you've called me. Hey, man, he misses you, dude. You're a comforting voice. My dust tox is different from regular dust tox. It's like my dust tox is in the top percentage of dust tox. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like, bragged about his dust tox and hung up. It's better because youngster Joey in the normal game has Rattata. So all he does is call you, tell you about how his Rattata is in the top tier of Rattata, and then he hangs up. <laughs> He's just like, I got this really cool rat. A spooky plate. Oh, why can't I be finding these plates in the last playthrough when I had the god ability where my typing would change to the plate I had? Then I could have a fighting type Gengar and literally no enemy would know what to do against me. All right, Kronk, we need to level you up. Come on, so there's, buddy. There's at minimum two enemies you have to fight. Technically, you could fight three on the top floor. I think there's only like one or two more that you have to fight besides that. Yo, is Kronk gonna level up off this one fight? Oh my goodness, Kronk, you're huge. The sunlight is strong with this one. Oh? Who are you fighting? Cubone. Okay, because sunny, sunny Day makes it so that the fire-type moves do more damage, and water-type does less. Hey, Cubone is throwing me through the spin cycle right now. What's he doing? He keeps, like, lowering some of my stats, and, like, the sun keeps, like, shining through. The sun isn't doing anything else for you. You don't gotta worry about that. Kronk, wake up! Kronk, wake up! Kronk, wake up! This is turn five, buddy. It's half past noon. Good lord, Kronk. Hey, let's slap with the crit. Let's get it. Kronk wants to learn curse. Oh, that's a Gamba move. Yo, Reggie level nine. Let's go. He has download. Oh, that's scary. Get hey. in there, Vinny. Kill him. I found a smoke ball. That's, uh, I, I don't remember. You can read the item description if you want. All right. Oh, wait. Tits, 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 tits. Yeah. I think I'm at the top. Uh, yeah. There's two more fights at minimum you have to do. That guy on the top right, you don't have to fight if you don't want to. So I just fought him and I actually kind of regret it because Kronk almost died. Kronk was asleep for five turns straight. He would not wake up. And Kronk's level 13, so I can no longer level. I mean, they're all still green. Only Reggie's got 10 health down and I can always use a potion on him. All right, Elder, let's fight. I have Ice Heal. Yeah, what's up, Karen? What's poppin', dude? Oh, he only has one Pokemon. And it's Krabby. Starabia? That would have been an awesome Pokemon to get. So if I was to fight Krabby... An old Amber. That's the second fossil I found. I can't use them, though. Yeah. I can't hatch a fossil or whatever until... You can't hatch a fossil? Yeah, you can, like, re resurrect fossils. That's where you typically get your boy. L Krabby. Way to do a th quarter of your health. Oh, my. Oh, another Vice Grip. Oh, God. I'm not exactly the biggest fan of Vice Grip, but he should be done after this one. Strawberry is now level four. Let's go, Strawberry. Oh, level five? Pop off, Strawberry. Let's go. This little Strawberry what? has a lot of health for being level five. Yeah, I also read that, and I was like, did I read that right? Yeah. <laughs> 
I'm like, hey, yo, buddy, calm yourself. Part of me kind of wants to fight this guy just for the money. It could be worth for the money. You just want to make sure you got the health to do it. Oh, an, uh, an Abra. Yo, you Yo I got some, I got some, I got some bad memories flying back. <laughs> I think he only knows teleport usually, so you can probably send in anybody you want. Yeah, we'll see. Let's just throw Turbo in there. If he does only know teleport, we'll find out here. Yep. But it failed. Can't leave as a trainer Pokemon, so he's just gonna sit there and let you fight him. All right. Time to see if I regret this. This is two. Rich girl Espen. A Glamow. Lamiao is not very strong at all. Hit him with a metronome hyper beam off rip. I don't know, maybe. I did six. Yeah, okay. Um, now I'm scared. Get in there, Reggie. Skadoosh. Strawberry's level six. Strawberry's really putting in the work. And then we got a chat tot. I'll tell you what the level of the uh, big boss man is. A level seven as elf. Whoa. Whoa, back it up there. Back up there, friend. Am I stuck using this move right now because of him? Oh, no. That's what Imprison does. That's right. Huh? I can't use any moves that we share. And the only damaging move I have is Rascal is confusion and since as elf has confusion i can't hurt it you showed us what you've got and it is Show indeed me what you good got. this technical machine however you should care more about your pokemon the way you treat your pokemon can be too harsh remember pokemon are not tools of war I forgot that was his name. Die, you lion. He calls himself the elder, but he was no match for me. Sure enough, those who lecture how you should be nice to Pokemon, they cannot defeat me. All I care about are strong Pokemon that win every time. The rest of them don't mean anything to me. Die, 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 I know, you made up the name, my friend. Yeah, I know, that's, that's the bad part. <laughs> And he's gone, just like that. So now what? I fight Mr. Elderman? Yeah. So I don't know what level Pokemon he has right now. He has three, and the first one was a level seven legendary for me. So oh, I'm trying to like... Tits! I didn't put... Oh, man. Well, here goes nothing. I believe in you. No, it's just that Strawberry is first up. We have a level seven Strandler. Bantler? Yeah. It's a normal type, but it's pretty strong because it has no evolution. So its stats are pretty good. No, we're just going to throw a Rockstar in there. Let's go, Lenny. Pop off. He's got a Floatzel. Okay, okay, so it's got a level 10 as the second Pokemon. Be careful. You're gonna want someone that can fight a level 10 Pokemon. And I got a Rockstar who's a level 12. Is he full health? Pretty much. He's got like four health points taken off. Now, I think the level 10 might be his ace, so um, hopefully yeah, the level third one 10 is not high whisk level. Whisk hash. Round and water. Rockstar's my highest, so I feel like I gotta use him. I don't know. I, I doubt a water gun would do damage against a water type. <laughs> That's a Rampardos. I don't like that. Bite? Oh, Bite did not do anything anything and he just mud slapped me oh my god that did a lot was that whisk a bit attack yeah, yeah it was like a mud slap or something yeah be careful my friend what are your pokemon looking like right now fruit at level seven reggie at level nine with 10 health missing turbo seven strawberry seven well you can't send in turbo he'll die you need eesh. You can't leave Rockstar in. If it did that much damage to him, Rockstar yeah. will die on a crit. That hurt. Wish Cash is like, I like him a lot, actually. He's underrated because he's kind of doofy looking. I mean, I could throw fruit in there. Astonish has a chance to flinch, but that's a ghost move. Wish Cash's only weakness is grass type, I'm pretty sure, so. Yeah, I got nothing like that. He resists fire and rock. He resists steel and poison. Reggie and Strawberry might have to carry this one out. Water gun. Okay, I shouldn't do too much. Did six. I don't know, man. Wait, he did six with water gun? Yeah. What else did he use against um, Rockstar? Mudslap? Yeah. Mudslap <laughs> is strong against Rockstar, so that's why it did so much to him. Six, so it'll do at most 12 damage on a crit, so you can take two more crits with Reggie before he dies. What else do you have on Reggie? Dizzy Punch, normal, knockoff, dark, foresight, normal, confusion ray, ghost. He's knockoff. I don't know what items he might be having. Yeah, that's what I, that's, that was the plan. That did nothing, and yeah, I don't think he didn't have anything on him. So that did, I went from 24 to 17. You can take a crit. You can take one crit from him no matter what. Reggie will live this attack no matter what. Afterwards, there's no guarantee of him living. Wish Cash is scary. I don't like it. Confused. Confused. Come on. Oh, no. That was a hard. That was a big one. Oh, that only did like three. I would potion. You're in, you're in crit death range right yeah, now. Yeah, I don't like that. I gotta be careful, though. I only have two potions left. That's all right. 
better to use them now than to die now. I could test out what, oh, ow. I feel like that did like 10. I completely forget what my health was at. I can see what a normal type does, but I doubt it does anything. A normal type. Whoa, though. never mind. I will shut the hell up. Joe, you gotta look at the, the numbers on your moves, not just the typing. Dizzy Punch could have like 90 power. You mean, I was looking at like the, how many times I could use that ability. Now I have a level 7 pseudo wodo Rock type Pokemon. Check moves on Reggie. So Dizzy Punch has 70 power and uh, Knock Off has what, 60? 20. Knock Off has 20? Mm hmm. Yee. That's, uh, you know, three and a half times the damage coming out of it and it's also on top of that uh a stab move i think actually do normal types get stabbed i don't think normal types get stabbed no you mean like category uh there is no stab so stab stands for same type attack boost so if you are a water type using a water type move there's a multiplier of one and a half times damage on it okay but normal types do not get stab bonuses so reggie will not get a one and a half times boost on D dizzy bump pseudo wudo will resist normal i think but <gasps> That's oh. a fighting type move. <laughs> and that means... That hurt. Oh my god, your team sucks against this guy. No, don't keep Reggie in. Don't keep no, Reggie in. Oh, that in. hurt. I'm not doing it. That hurt way too much. That hurt Why? way too much. You're gonna get hit by it again, my friend. Yeah, there's only four. I can... Okay, okay. Who am I throwing in? My gut would say Rockstar. I mean, he's kind of hurt. No, but... Rockstar will die. Rockstar is weak to fighting. He will also get hit for double damage or whatever it is. Strawberry is weak to fighting. Turbo is, I don't know, sucks. Fruit is not weak to fighting, but I don't know if Fruit can do much against this guy. What's Fruit's a move? Astonish and Mud Slap. 30 power for Astonish and 20 power for Mud Slap. Pseudo Wudo is weak to ground type moves so you could use that against him might have to do reggie's just gonna get his shit fucking rocked all right fruit i believe in you come on buddy come on fruit we you can be our hero baby oh no how much does rock throw to the fruit oh my, oh god. my god dude that was a crit. see fruit resists both rock and fighting so he's like the ultimate thing to fight against him and he just lost half his health on rock throw are you kidding me that was a crit too that was a crit that's a stab crit rock throw that's like the absolute most damage it could do to him and he he technically could live with one health so that I, I, I like your odds joe i like your odds we're we're playing with fire here this is lenny's life on the line too <laughs> hit him hit him with a whatever you got mud slap I hit him mud slap is. That was super effective. Yeah, it was. Oh, brother. Oh my god. That was super effective. Oh god. This pseudo would is scary. I feel like I have to use a potion, but you I only do. have one potion left. But who would you use it on? It's a question. I don't know if I'd use it on Krogon. I mean, because fruits hurt. Literally half of my roster is gonna get smoked by this guy. What's he using? Low kick? Low kick, yeah. So low kick is based on the weight of the other Pokemon, I think. That's why Regigigas took so much damage, because Regigigas is fat. Yeah, he's a big boy. He's a couple hundred kilograms. Turbo will die to that. Rockstar is probably pretty thick, too. I don't know. You could see what Strawberry can do against it, maybe. You could scum it with Strawberry and spam minimize. He's low kick. Oh my god, 12. Dude, I am like, I am like, oh, I don't know what to do here. Strawberry will die to a crit, but would live a normal. I only have one potion. Yeah, this is really not fortunate at all. Rockstar is probably your best bet, but like, can he survive the low kick? What's Rockstar at? He's at 26. So a potion would definitely get him to back to full. Honestly, Rockstar might be able to tank it anyways, but then you'd have to heal on entry anyways. All depends on when you want to do all this. Because at least if I heal him now, obviously I, I lose a little bit of that potion. You might lose Strawberry. You might lose Strawberry. That's what you'll lose. If you I might. heal him now. Yeah, you might lose Strawberry. So if Rockstar can tank it, I'll just switch him now, heal him next turn. And then water gun Pray this to thing God. Dude, holy shit. This is like intense as hell. Yeah, it's get, it gets scary when you realize that you could lose the thing right here and under a tree. <laughs> to a fake-ass tree. You're a fucking imposter. All right, Rockstar. Oh, Rockstar. I believe. Oh, yeah, Rock okay. Rockstar is huge. Rock throw is huge. He's throwing. Literally throwing. <laughs> you could get the full health off the potion, right? Yeah, I'm, I'm going to do that. Or you could water gun him now. I'm not going to risk it. Full health. Rock throw again. Oh, he, li he is literally throwing. You're... Throwing so bad. Would water gun be the move here? Water gun is the move. He's weak to water. Because this thing is a rock type. Oh my god. Oh my god. 
Oh my Get him out of here, Rockstar. Oh, he, he literally threw. And Strawberry got points. And Fruit got points. And Rockstar yeah, got points. And Reggie got points. Everyone's yeah, but who's the points. third points? Your Tina. Sorry, Turbo. No points for you, buddy. <laughs> Oh, wait, that was a third Pokemon. That's right. Oh, my God. Not Turbo would have been whack. So Turbo fast. would have been done, reduced to atoms. Hmm. The way you battled is quite elegant. You should be able to stand up to Falconer. And you should be able to make good use of this. It is a technical machine called Flash. Take it with you. I don't like the old man giving me Flash. Yeah, it's kind of, it's a little concerning, I'm not gonna lie. So it's like kind of a useless move normally, but maybe it randomized for you. For me, it's still Flash because my game considers Flash a field move and I did not randomize field move. I think it's still Flash. No oh, good move. Not really, it sucks, but like it'll let you look in the cave to the right of town. Oh man. I don't know. Yeah, all I know is we ain't fighting fucking nothing in this damn building. Like, get me the hell out of here. I need to get out of this damn building, and I need to go tap a kidney so bad. And also, Dixon, we have just crossed the four-hour mark. How are you feeling about that one? I'm feeling pretty good. You know what I think, Joe? This is what I think. This is what I'm thinking. This is what I'm feeling. Let me hear it. Give me, give me, oh, I didn't mean to do that. Kick this gym leader's ass and then call it a day. Oh, that, that is a, that's a solid game plan. I, I'm, I'm liking ass. that one. So there is two trainers you gotta technically fight before this man, though. Fair warning. Well, you could skip them if you don't want to fight them. Yeah, I mean, I can fight them, but I need to heal my boys first. My boys are Oh, hurting. yeah, you don't gotta fight them right, right away. It's a level nine Pokemon, and I don't know, whatever this next thing is. Heal my boys pronto, please. Holy Jeebus. Hey, who taught you a flying move? You're a fish. 